welcome back to my channel and uh, this is his glitch tutor and what I do here is I solve technical drain problems and also provide very important information that you can make use of for you to have a better performance in your technical drawing examinations. We are still working on this uh, uh, machine drawing and we as you can see we have worked on the front elevation and the plan now we want to work on the end elevation because so that those are the three things that we are asked to uh, to produce on this uh, particular uh, uh, machine drawing so we want to work on the end elevation as we are instructed and we ask to place it on the right side of the front elevation and this is being done in third angle projection well for projection this is the front elevation this is the plan and we are placing the end elevation here on the right side of the front elevation okay so this is the object itself so we are now looking at this object in this direction so we are looking at this object in this direction we are going to see this view we are going to this see this, this is going to give us a circular path and this is going to give us a rectangle uh because it's not a square it's a rectangle so as i said that this from year to year is 88 and from year to year is 76 then some parts are going to be hidden like this part will be hidden and also this part will also be hidden in the end elevation so let's start and see what we need to do so the first that we need to do uh okay let me just explain some things here so if you look at uh everything that we have here most surely on this part and also on this part so they are all mounted on this rectangular part on, on this part here on this particular part that i'm touching here so they're all mounted here so everything here that we have here will be mounted on this and also everything that we have on this part will also be mounted on this as you can see so that's what you need to bear in mind okay now so the first thing i need to do here i'm not going to produce any line from the plan so i'm just going to construct the uh the end elevation here so i may produce some lines from here but most surely this center line has to be produced so which i've already uh produced so and this is okay so the next thing i'm going to do here is that i will draw a vertical line so i will draw a just move away a little bit and draw a vertical line here like this okay then um, this part here i'm going to draw a horizontal line from here so for this part which i said everything is mounted on it and i'll also draw a vertical line from here okay so uh looking at what we have here looking at what we have here so let me show you something so um so uh for distance from here to here that are produced that is that of 88 millimeters from here to here is 88 millimeters then uh for distance from here to here this is 76 millimeters so 76 millimeter don't forget that we are producing half of the given dimensions that means all the dimensions are to be divided by two so i'm going to divide 76 by two 70 by because we're now looking at it in this direction so this is what we are looking at distance from year to year this is 70 millimeters so 70 by 2 that is 38 and 38 by 2 will give us 19 millimeters so um so i'll just take 19 millimeters to the right side and 19 millimeters to the left side so this is 19 millimeters here and this is also uh, 19 millimeters so making it 38 millimeters so here i will draw a vertical line here so here i will draw a vertical line okay so i draw a vertical line but this is going to be a thick line at once so i make it a thick line at once as you can see on the diagram given to also this is a thick line at once and this is also a thick line so at once okay so all this will be thick lines okay so all right so so what i've done here now is for the uh first part that we have here 
so which is this rectangular face here so the next one i'm going to do is this is going to give us circular face so for this cylindrical part so it's going to give us a circle so uh the diameter of the circle is uh diameter of the circle is 80 uh, sorry 66 millimeters but what i'll just do is that i'll advise 66 by millimeters by two and th uh, that's the three so the three by two so you know what is going to give us that is 16 uh, point five. so which i've done here already i'll just take this distance from here to here and i will come here and draw a circle so this will give us a circle like this all right so this is how this part will look like so the next, next thing that we're going to do is that um so the next thing to be placed on this is this part that we have here so if you look at this now so we have a curve part here we have an arc here and arc here and then we have this flat part here so um for what we are going to do first is to produce this circular part so we produce a circle then we now make this to show on it so um uh, for this part that we have here for this part that we have here um so the circular part that we are going to produce the diameter is 48 half of 48 is 24 and 24 by 2 is 12 so we are going to produce a circle of radius 12 millimeters partially first all right here i've produced the circle i produced the circle but um we are not done with that part so let me show you something so we are going to see this uh straight part and this straight part so what we need to do now is that so this is this time from year to year is for the straight part that we are going to produce here so um so i'll just set um this here i don't want to draw a line as i've set it here like this on this line so i will just produce a straight line from year to year so this is a chord and then i'll come up here like this and i'll also produce i will also produce the same line here so from year to year like this okay so the next thing i'm going to do is to take my compass put at the center here and i will make this a thick line from here to here and i'll make this curve thick and also the same thing here all right so everything that we have on this left side of the object has been produced so we have produced this part we have produced circular part and this rectangular part has been produced there's something that we have not produced that is this hole is going to be hidden when we are looking at it in this direction it's going to be hidden from us so we need to produce that and don't forget that the diameter of the hole is 12 and the half of 12 is 6 and six by two will give us three so i'm going to take a measurement of three millimeters so from here to the uh left side and so three millimeters from here to the right side and do not forget that this uh hole is hidden from us it's going to be hidden from us so i will just so uh draw from here so make a short dashes line okay then here also i make sure that she's lying all right so the hole is present there now so that's what we have there so the next thing that we have here now is um so on this part so this part is going to be hidden from us this is going to be hidden from us and is at the uh, center here so it's around what's at the center here um okay so at the center here so i'm going to okay 
so the thickness from here to here this is 32 this is 32 so 32 by 2 that's 16 and then we have to take uh, 22 millimeters from here to here half of 22 is 11 and also from here to here is also uh, we are going to produce 11 11 so i will just come straight here so um at the center here so i will take a measurement of 11 millimeters to the uh, left side and 11 millimeters sorry it is from this end so from this end i will take 11 millimeters here 11 millimeters here and also from this end i will take 11 millimeters so the rest is 16 millimeters in the middle here so that is going to be hidden from us so all i will do is to is to make it a short dashes line short dashes line from here down to go like this Okay, so I'll also do the same thing on this side. Short dashes line. All right, so that's for that part. So, and then for the uh, circular part that we have here, for the circular part that we have here, which is also going to be hidden. So this part here that we have here, so we are going to produce it and this now from year to year is uh 44 millimeters half of 44 is uh 22 is 22 millimeters so we are going to produce that all right so what i've done just done here so i've produced uh lines from this part of this circle and from this part of this circle i produced lines i want to make use of them so and at the same time i also need to produce horizontal uh lines from here to get the uh the width of this so i'll draw a horizontal line here and here i will draw a horizontal line here like this so then um so i'm going to I'm going to draw a line, a line from here. Um, okay, sorry. To draw this part now so i just uh the thickness of uh, the distance from year to year is the width of this uh cylindrical part that is going to be hidden from us when we are looking at it in this direction so what i will just do is that i will take the distance from year to year so distance from here to year i've taken it so i'll bring it to this point here so i bring it to this point here now i make an arc here like this okay then i will take distance from here to here so put it here and on this side here i will make an arc okay so those are the two points that we need for the thickness of that part okay so then i'm going to to draw a line so this is going to be hidden it's going to be hidden so we have uh, many things that are hidden here okay and then this also will be hidden up to this line then I'm going to so this will also be hidden okay so I'll also make this a short dashes line okay 
all right so we have that so other parts will also be reading so like this one here so the distance okay um so many things are going to be hidden here so for this one um so which is the counter ball hole that we have so we have that distance so this inner distance from year to year is three millimeters so we are told that it's three millimeter deep so i just take like one millimeter so i'm going to i'm going to end it here i'm going to end it here just let me see what i could, can do to bring out that part all right so i've been able to put everything in place so for this uh true hole so this is the hidden part this eating so we have it from year to year and then we have what uh, this part so this uh hole here or this hole so we only have a little part of it being produced as we have in diagrams as simple as i've shown it here all you need to do is to practice thank you and keep on practicing